Dave Jack's cool with the blues here, so it's clean out the refrigerator time. I've got some cooked uh, spaghetti squash and uh, some poblano peppers, but I don't know. We got so I'm gonna make a uh, like a, uh, a spaghetti squash lasagna, and I've got some beautiful burgers from Four Mile River Farms, short rib brisket burgers. There's some beautiful meat right here. I tell you, so I probably. I probably I want to make half like a vegetarian, you know, with no meat, and I'm going to use half that's got meat in it. So, a little olive oil. It's important to season it every step of the way. Some pepper. Careful inhaling that. the fire up a little bit. I want to get going, throw an onion in there, and to get that going, I'm going to use a half an onion. It's a piece of garlic. Got to have garlic in lasagna. One time I was in school and uh, I was I was in charge of the class or my group for that day, and it was uh, the assignment was make lasagna, and it, the recipe didn't call for any garlic. You know, Italian kitchen. So I took it upon myself to put a ton of, you know, a bunch of fresh garlic in there because that's what lasagna calls for. And I got called in at the end of the chef's office. He had a lot of compliments on lasagna. He said, "Oh, one of the other instructors in the other class said plenty of had a lot of nice garlic." I said, oh, "Yeah." I put. He said, "Where in the recipe did you?" see that there was a call for garlic. I said it didn't, but I took, you know, I took, uh, I guess, Liberty to, Liberties to put it in there. He said, well, you flunked. You and your team flunked for the day. You didn't, you didn't follow the recipe. I said, Chef Colucci, are you Italian? He said, your mother, your mother would disown you if, if, you, made a, if you made a lasagna cook without garlic, but one of the lessons, you know, I guess is to follow the recipe if you don't know exactly what you're doing. I'm going to cut the onion kind of small because I kind of want it to disappear. I don't want big chunks in the lasagna. Okay. possible bring your bring the cutting board over to the skillet or bring the skillet to the cutting board best way to do it we have our spaghetti squash I'm gonna put some olive oil in the bottom hopefully to prevent it well you know with the with glass you don't have to worry too much it doesn't really stick to the bottom so, uh, got a spaghetti squash. See how we take this here. I love, I love, I love this part of this. You know, I roasted this in the oven. Just I, I cut it in half, took most, you know, all the seeds I could out of it, and then uh, put a little olive oil, salt, pepper, and. Uh, Roasted it down, 
uh, cut side down is how I do it. We're just going to clean up a little bit and we'll be right back. All right, our ground beef, round it up real nice. Come on in and check it out. Add a little of that Daddy Jack seasoning just for some color. A little paprika, a little garlic powder, white black, white pepper, black pepper, a little garlic powder. All right, so I got some marinara. I'm just gonna like flavor up. We got any squash kind on the bland side, so we're gonna we're gonna spruce it up a little bit. Put some parmesan. Gotta have the flavor in it. Got some fresh uh, basil. Some fresh basil. You know, me and my fresh tarragon, or I, oh, it's not fresh. If you had fresh, that'd be great. All right. What was that, Jack? Huh? Oh, tarragon? Okay. what did I say, fresh basil? No, you just said fresh tar. Oh. <laughs> tarragon. <laughs> Like I said, I try to talk talk and cook at the same time. It's like I can't talk and chew gum at the same time, so. That looks good already. Always have to uh, season it. So I figure that's like a, a replacement of, of the noodle, so. I'm gonna try it out. Mm -hmm. It's good. So, not everybody's gonna like the uh, some roasted poblano pepper. So I'll make sure I put that on the meat side. We gotta remember which is which. That's right where we want the meat. Okay. Right. Put that on that side. And then uh, so we'll mix that up a little bit. right back. I'm going to get some mushrooms going for the vegetarian side. We'll be right back. Give me that, Axel. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Ah. <laughs> Go get it. Go get it. All right. Hey, get your nose out of that, Axel. Hey, so uh, I'm going to cut up some of these mushrooms here. I want to kind of like on a bigger, kind of on the bigger slices, so they got a little texture. They don't they don't disappear into the uh, lasagna. <laughs> Ready? Again, that the only problem with electric is I get I get the I get the settings uh, screwed up a little bit. going to uh, season these up a little bit. 
I say that a lot, don't I? Mm -hmm. Season them up a little bit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you gotta put the flavor in it. Little Daddy Jack's blackened seasoning. And uh, what I do is I just kind of let them, if I want a nice, uh, like, uh, seared mushrooms, I don't, I don't, I don't uh, mix them up right away. Let them really brown up a little bit, just like a good steak. Let that set for a minute. And, uh, well, you know, I don't have, I don't have any, uh, like mozzarella, provolone. Next best thing for this dish, nice American. Okay. Build that up a little bit. Save a little bit of that for you know who later. Okay. See, we just tossed them once already, and uh, a little bit of sauce on top. All right, this side's ready to go. that go for another 10, 15, 30 seconds. We'll be right back. Okay, here we are. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. Nice. Don't over mix it. Don't over mix it. You don't like that noise, huh? No. All right. <laughs> How's that look? Delicious. Yum. Okay, I made that vegetarian side just for you. Okay. Isha. Take it. All right. All day. Now we're just gonna let that set up. Probably put it in the refrigerator for an hour or two. And my daughter Rachel, daughter's Rachel Lucy coming over. Pop that bad boy in the oven. Got some green beans in there. We're gonna mm -hmm. cook those up. Okay. All right. <laughs> so I uh, preheated the oven and I, I just really took it out of the fridge. But I'm gonna slow cook it like at 300. And uh, girls will be here an hour, about an hour and 45 minutes. Uh, we're down, we're down to the nitte gritte. Lucy and Rachel, yeah. come here. Wes, you want to come in? Sure. Be on the video? Uh, see YouTube you. sensation. <laughs> I don't have to do it tonight. So <laughs> All right. My babies came, my baby girls came. On this side, Lucy. Okay. Yeah. You know where to go. Yeah. Hey. So, uh, you excited? About we were going to do Chinese food. I said, you know what? You're coming over for dinner. I said, we're going to whip this deal together, you know? Clean out the, clean out the fridge. Yeah. Well, not just clean out the oh, fridge. Oh, right? I was a little excited for some wonton <laughs> food. <but laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. All right. So, let's check this out yeah, now. Okay. okay. So, we got a little Parmigiani if anybody wants some extra. Okay. And there's some green beans. We get a bowl for those. Here, just use the salad bowl here. Look. Okay. We want the recipe. I'll let you know Obviously. how we cook them. Do you think we could watch the video? Mm. Oh, beforehand, if you'd like to know. Yeah, I'd like to know. All right. Oh my gosh. 
I like sassy pants. <laughs> Seems dangerous, Axel. No. He'll only do that when we turn our backs. Those right. green beans look fantastic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Italian oh green. Oh. Italian green beans. Delicious. And uh, mm -hmm. let's check out the piece de resistance here. Woo! Sugar, sugar. Sugar wow. doogie. Look at that. Huh? And then the, uh, the garlic. The garlic bread, garlic bagels. Wow. Right? Grandma's Hadley wear. Nothing but the best. Yeah. Wow. Oh, wow. Y'all hungry? You didn't you didn't snack this afternoon, no, no, I hope. Not even a slight snack. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Okay. See that now like that over I like to give this. Some for Axel. All right. <laughs> Dan Jack's cooking with the blues. Time to dig in. All right. <laughs> Love you, babes. Love you. Keisha doing it, doing it on the videos. Doing her thing. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go. Let's go eat. This looks delicious. <laughs> it's a creation. You think so, Wes? Huh? It smells great. I'll give you the recipe. As soon as we walked in, How's we were like, delicious. Rachi? Uh huh. <laughs> what would you like? Meat is great. Okay. Yeah. Not what I. Uh, All right, well then, Benji, then. <laughs> okay. A scoop of each. A scoop of each, then. Come on. Okay. Now give a scoop of this also. Huh? <laughs> yeah. All right. I didn't put the ricotta in there. You know, you can. Um, have you already told your YouTube family about the grape juice? <laughs> oh yeah, it's a video just went up. Here to tell you, delicious. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah not too Fritz, sweet. Fritz uh -huh. across the street. Yeah. Wes, yeah. one of each, please. One of each. Nice, good decision. I know you were late. You saw his so reaction to mine. <laughs> so. Wasn't gonna follow up with mm. your response. <laughs> <laughs> I don't, oh, wow. we don't eat, I like spaghetti squash. We're not. Yeah, me too. Yeah, perfect. Wow, you're really loading them up, Dad. Okay. okay. Thank you, sir. All right, salad. Anybody? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Sure. You have room? Yeah. Good. Keisha, yeah. what would you like? I'll have the veggie. Okay. <laughs> you <want> <laughs> <laughs> Almost got derailed there. Thank you. I'll try just a little bit of the meat, too. All right. So, can I introduce you some salad as well? Sure. Thank you. Drop it. Drop it? <laughs> Drop it. <laughs> what a dog. Oh, tag team it. There right. you go. Wow. It's an assembly line. Yeah? Dad, what uh, flavor are you getting into? All right. Mmm. Yeah, fabulous. Is it good? Yes. All right. Daddy Jack's co one of blues here. Nothing, nothing better than to eat, sit at the table with family. That's right. And forget that Chinese food. You do that any day of the week. <laughs> we don't need it. <laughs> peace. How about the garlic bread? Anybody try the yeah, garlic bagel? I already have a piece. Oh, okay. Please. All right. <laughs> Axel, sit. You'll have yours when we're done if you behave yourself. <laughs> That's the biggest plate I got right here. <laughs> All right. <laughs>